going to give you her two shampoos and the reason for that is because the first shampoo and a lot of people make this mistake you know they do one shampoo and then they just take more and more product because they're not getting any leather but your first shampoo you shouldn't really expect to have all that much leather because what it's doing is it's just cutting through the grease that you've got in there or any product that you've got in the hair particularly with this particular range the heel range from Maria Neela you want to make sure that you rub it into the scalp because that's where it does its a lot of its work once you've rubbed it in and you've got it right into the scalp and into the hair just leave it for one or two minutes and let it work before you do your second one Great. don't be afraid to really like rub rub the hair a lot of us you know when we're shampooing at home we just concentrate on the scalp yeah. and that's all we do but don't be afraid to like get the rest of it and really work work it because that will get it get it a lot cleaner okay so we'll leave that for one minute after one minute we'll come back we'll rinse it off and then we'll continue with the second shampoo let's give it a rinse so now we'll continue with the second shampoo and here you should feel we get a lot more leather one thing that's important to think of when you're shampooing um, particularly with this type of product which is a scalp and hair product is that you really make sure that you massage right the way over the whole head so you get actually a nice even application of the product right throughout the scalp and then also through the hair. So you take all the suds that you create on the scalp and squeeze it out to the lengths and work it there once again. I'm going to leave this just for about 30 seconds and then we'll rinse again. And here we want to be really thorough to rinse the product out. Okay Petra, so now we've, we've shampooed the hair. What we want to do before we put the mask in is just pat dry the excess moisture uh, right from from the scalp and also from the hair and the reason we do that is because the water can act as a bit of a barrier if there's too much water there we're going to attack that scalp with the Maria Neela heel mask which is a lovely luxurious texture as well dig in grab not quite a fistful but about so much and the trick here rub it all over the hands you see it's a lovely beautiful yeah. texture this rub it right through in between the fingers and then we start to work it in first on top of the hair and then work it into the scalp and push it right into the scalp and now comes the best part for you la massage yeah. here we go <laughs> I've been told I'm pretty good at this too this is you know as part of your routine even in the morning is just to make sure that you massage it into the scalp particularly if you have a scalp problem or if you have hair growth problems is to just stimulate that scalp. So now what we're going to do is we will rinse this mask out after we've left it for a few minutes and then we will carry on with our conditioner. Using the sister to the shampoo, the heel conditioner, work the conditioner all over your hands so you get it in between your fingers as well so you don't just land it all in one spot and then you just start by running your hands just really lightly over the hair because you've got it in between your fingers you run your fingers through and squeeze it in since this is an active shampoo and conditioner it's working on the scalp mm -hmm. to reduce dandruff and scalp problems we want to make sure that we get it right in all the way down to the scalp all right so now we've shampooed we've masked we've massaged we've conditioned and now all that's left to do mate is to give this a rinse now here's another tip if your hair is really dry or brittle or you find it's a bit frizzy leave just a touch of the conditioner in get it off the scalp but leave a, a touch of the conditioner in through the mid lengths and ends and that's going to control the curl and the frizz a lot better so the thing to think of here Petra yeah. is that after your shampoo use the mask because that's the most effective um, product in the series once you've done the mask then you use your conditioner to lock it in because the conditioner seals the hair and the scalp and it makes it harder for the mask to penetrate shampoo mask conditioner